It's 8 a.m. inside the 15th Circuit Drug Enforcement Unit's headquarters, and law enforcement officers from multiple agencies are being briefed. The Delta Motel has been a, a nuisance to the city of Conway for years and years and years. Cocaine, heroin, even fentanyl, all drugs investigators say suspect tenants living in the motel are selling. There's some kind of conspiracy going on at this hotel, and we're going to continue to investigate it and try to get to the bottom of it. 8.15 and the team gears up to execute the search warrants. All right, remember the first couple of vehicles, drive in as far as you can so we can get as many vehicles in as possible. And just 15 minutes later, all at once, four rooms are raided. This one's unique in the fact that we were doing simultaneous search warrants, um, and it had to be that way in order for us to uh, get in and first of all, secure the area to make it safe. Within moments, three suspects are detained and DEU agents begin processing the rooms. It looks, uh, from our point of view, is that several rooms were set up and they had people inside that were selling. The DEU is quick to point out the success of this operation is due to the work by Conway Police Department's Street Crimes Unit. They picked two really, really good police officers and they've got in, they've dug, and they've looked for intel, and they're making cases, and they're, ha they're having a good, strong impact on the community. The unit started in August of 2016, and the officers told us this partnership is vital to taking on larger scale operations. If a department is short on resources, then let's get together. Uh, you know, the Street Crimes Unit is set up to support us in many of the things that we do as well as us support them. In addition to the three suspects arrested as part of the warrant, an additional three were taken in for drug possession. The DEU says this kind of bust would not be possible if not for the collaboration they receive. So we had to bring in people outside agencies like the Sheriff's Department, um, Coastal Carolina University, uh, Horry County Police. Uh, there's people from Myrtle Beach PD here. Um, and when we all work together like that, it makes it easier to take on these larger operations.